Hello, everyone, and welcome to the Indiana Gear Up YouTube channel. We're so excited that you joined us today. As Indiana Gear Up works to build capacity and resources and to be of support to our schools, teachers, parents, students, and community partners, we first want to let you know of ways in which we can connect. As you're joining us today on our YouTube channel at Indiana Gear Up, please subscribe to our page, share with your friends, family, any community members that may be interested in learning more about the resources or projects that we're working on uh, throughout the remainder of the year into the summer, professional development that we have, as well as preparing for next year. Uh, you can find us on social media platforms such as Facebook at Indiana Gear Up, Twitter at Indiana Gear Up, as well as Instagram at Indiana Gear Up. Also, you can reach out to us via email, indianagearup at purdue.edu. We have staff members behind the scenes who are readily available to answer any questions that you may have. Um, today, we'll be looking at how you connect with us on our website at indianagearup.org. And more specifically, our resource tab that's available for teachers right now. Um, we have an Indiana Gear Up COVID-19 resource folder that's available and it's free. This was developed um, by a seasoned expert of team, uh, a team of regional directors um, who have really just have an ample amount of experience in the education field. Uh, there are several documents here um, that you can browse through and use at your leisure. Uh, today, more specifically, we're gonna be taking a look at the Gear Up Educational website resources. And each day we're going to be sharing a tutorial on one of these websites that is specific to the subject for the high school level, the link that is available, the description, as well as the services that are currently offered. Again, we hope that, that this can be of use to you now or in the near future for teachers, uh, staff members, parents, um, or community members. So enjoy. All right, our educational website resource that we have for you today is Clark Creative Education. And this in particular website has a, over a thousand free pages of teaching resources and digital material that is available right now for free. And what's nice about this is that it has the free premium resources, as you can see on various topics, which you have to kind of go in and dig around and see what it is uh, that you would like to use. Or there is instructional materials below that are specified by the subject, and then there are units within each one of those that may align to your curriculum and standards in which you are uh, teaching. So that can be reinforcement, there's instructional materials and activities, as well as uh, practice within each one of these down below. But today we're gonna be taking a look at 21st century math projects in particular. And, and I really like this uh, tab because uh, it has a pretty easy access to what it is you may be looking for. As you can see, here's the specific subjects, math, science, verbal, or world topics. And this is demo, but again, they are all free. So if you go ahead and scroll down here, you can click on the demo math tab. And you can look at the various activities in which are listed. Uh, again, with Gear Up being a STEM related program and field, uh, there are STEM immersion activities here that are pretty cool. The one we'll be taking a look at today uh, is the rational functions and anesthesiologists. What's nice about this is you can do a simple introductory uh, piece about an anesthesiologist, kind of talk about it, the career background or uh, educational background required. Uh, to become an anesthesiologist and really how it's one of the most difficult degrees or certifications to reach uh, as four years undergraduate, four years of medical school, and then four to seven years of residency and internship um, because it is such a high risk uh, job field. So uh, as you look at this particular web, our, uh, activity, you can see that there are five, pat five patients here and you're looking at the rational functions of these. Um, again, the model is listed, walking them through, 
um, determining the evidence and showing the work of their space in order to become, come up with an analysis and a conclusion of the particular um, situation that is presented here um, will be beneficial to help them think through that process. And uh, again, this is printable. Down below is a second page that provides the answer key. So again, this is a great resource, uh, real world application uh, to some of those STEM activities or uh, 21st century skill building uh, activities that the students can work through and that you can use in your classroom. Thank you for tuning in with us today. We hope to see you soon.